Hello wonderful family, another glorious day and another beautiful opportunity to share the word with you. Hallelujah. Praise God. Today's one is going to be a very quick one. I just want us to cast our minds back to um, scripture. And um, generally speaking, the fact that God forgave us our sins in Christ. When Christ died on the cross, our sin Christ became sin for us and God forgave us all our sin. Now, we were so utterly worthless, so to speak, because of our sin. But God did not look at that. He didn't wait for us to repent first before he sent Christ. He sent Christ to die before we even had the consciousness to ask for forgiveness. So he already forgave us of our sins before we could even ask for it. Out of love. Now do you know that it is the same way he expects us to forgive those who have offended us? No less. He actually tells us that we should do that. Say we should forgive those who have offended us even as Christ has forgiven us. As God forgave us, we are to forgive our neighbors. And the reason behind that is your faith will not work if you hold somebody in bondage as a prisoner in your heart. Because faith is of the heart and faith works by love. And love does not work by hate. Faith will not work if you hold somebody in your heart. The Bible says that if you do not, or if you hate somebody, you are a murderer. Your faith won't work. In the spirit realm, you'll be aligning yourself with the demonic, not with God and his angelic beings or the Holy Spirit. So you've got to forgive. Let go. He says that, look, I, God, will deal with the matter for you. He says, vengeance is mine. I will repay. So let it be in his hands. Forgive and let them go. God will deal with them. He, 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 will, he will cause them, or he will, he will nudge at their hearts for them to repent. And if they make their hearts hard, or harden their hearts, then they will fall into um, big trouble with him. But let that trouble not come from you. Leave it up to God. God bless you. Hallelujah.